ETC, we start with one of our charts. So I want to give a quick update. And if we refer to our analysis, since the price was here, we mentioned we're looking for buy. After we get this correction, we see the price drop. Anyway, if we refer to my last analysis, there is no much changes and still we are within this corrective move. And mostly we can refer to the indicator for the divergence. Then how we can look for trade, Either we look for the reversal as a sharp move flag, or we put our entry above 48, at 48, above this correction. In case the price reverses as a sharp move, and the targets we can look for is 50.5 following by 52. All right, that's mean we're looking for the targets based on lower time frame. Anyway, this is the targets we're looking for based on one hour chart. Anyway, we start with the daily chart, and based on daily chart, we mentioned we're looking for this correction relative to this. That's why I mentioned if we get any reversal, any opportunity for buy, we'll take it. And based on daily chart, we're looking for 65 following by 77 at the targets, all right? But based on daily chart, we don't have any trade setup for buy. And if we move to forward chart, similar to what we explained based on one hour chart, we're looking at this correction. Any trade for buy, we will take it. And we need to see the breakout of this one. And mostly we need to see the breakout of this correction to confirm we are within the uptrend. And after that, we can look for 58 following by 65 as a target. And again, if we move to one hour chart, we mentioned how we can look for trade. We need to see the breakout of this correction, all right? In this case, we just follow the chart. If I see any update, I will share, thanks.